Hey everybody, is your foot really a foot? Hi everyone, your creative educator here, and welcome to Sparks the Flames Education, where you get great science, math, and reading content, and really fun and creative ways of inspiring learning. Remember to subscribe, hit the notification so that you can see our new videos on Mondays. Like and share, and yes, subscribe now. One. Uh-huh. Two. Uh-huh. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. <laughs> but mine, I guess. Still studying geometry, and today we learn about the measurement called the foot or feet. Okay, people, so we got all these shoes. One of them must fit the measurement of a feet. Me! Okay, Rocco, come put your foot. Come, come here, Rocco. <laughs> One feet is 12 inches. So we're gonna find 12 inches. So I got 12 inches, right? So whichever shoes meets up to here. Okay? So we're going to here. So let's go. Shoe number one. It's shoe number one, the foot. Hey, that's mine! <laughs> shoe number one is not the foot. Okay. You got shoe number two. Not even. Not even. Okay, shoe number three. Not even. Not. So that's not the foot. <sighs> This is definitely not it. So cute though. Aww. Goodbye. My turn. Okay, we're getting closer. This is nine. Oh, yeah. elephant foot. <laughs> elephant foot near. Oh man, that's still not a foot. That's still not a foot. There is no foot. Okay, let's try this one. Still not a foot. No, no, give me that. Ta da da da. Here comes a magic slipper. Still not a foot. This is gonna be a foot, I All think. All right, here goes. Not even. Still not a foot. Okay, people, we did not find a shoe that measures one foot, but oh. 12 inches I gives know. one foot. So which foot they use to measure? <laughs> this is gonna be funny, go. <laughs> it's, my, it's my foot. <laughs> We have a winner. We have a winner. <laughs> this I is the foot. This is the foot that they used to measure one foot. This is a standardized one foot. That's it, people. That's my one slipper, feet. Though. We found it. That's my slipper. <laughs> Good job. All right, guys. So in Jamaica, this is what we used to do, like right? people when they're a foreign, right? When you buy shoes, they used to put. You have to put their foot on this. So stand up on this. And they need the and they need the shoe size, <laughs> so they used to trace out the shoe size for one piece of paper. <laughs> yeah, you're good. Trace out the shoe size for one piece of paper, just like this, and cut it out and send it. Now right, you trace out the shoe size, and then you take the shoe size and you put it in the shoes when you go to the store to see if it will fit. Or right, you match it to the bottom of the shoes to see if it will fit. You know, whenever I pull up a phone and then something, they so say you take the shoes. You go to the store, you match the print out to the shoes, or you actually cut it out and fit it in the shoes. Yeah, to see if it's gonna work. So that's a fun fact right there. That's so where did the measurement of a foot come from? This is what our research says. Okay, so my suggestion is King Henry was involved in making the first 12 inch foot. So what about the stories about the Romans foot? Having There's a similar I'll, I'll say about Julius Caesar. Julius Caesar was not involved. It was involved. He's a Roman. Oh, wow. That shut me up. Okay, people. So, in general, the measurement of the foot came from somebody's foot that they just made the standard measurement. Huh. And this standardized measurement is only used in English-speaking countries. And we know why. Colonization. In fact, around the world, the international system or international unit of measure is the metric system and is also used in science. In fact, many places such as Africa have measurement systems that were developed way before any of these systems. Thank you for joining us. Join us next week Monday. We'll have another video. Please go to the website www.sparsofflameseducation.com and check out all the goodies that we have on the website. Please remember to hit that subscribe, like, and share, and see you all next Monday. Peace out. Thank you for joining us. Join us next week Monday. We'll